y'all, it's your girl Suzette with Crafting with Susie, and I am back with you guys today for Frost Tube Friday, and this is Frost Tube number four. Um, today I am just going to be doing basically a haul from different merchants that I have been purchasing from uh, for the past few weeks. I was going to do my new starts, my whips, my progress, all of that, but this video will be way too long. So I will make sure I do that um, in week three of this month. So if you guys are working on anything, no matter if it's coloring, diamond painting, cross stitch, um, get a snack, get something to drink, I'm gonna not, I'm gonna do my best to try not to make this a very long video. And I got a lot of stuff and I'm so excited. Okay, so again, just a re uh, recap. This is a more relaxed version of my YouTube channel. It's not so like structured because this is all new to me. I am very new to cross stitch. I started August of 2023 and I have completely fell in love with it. I'm very proud of the fact that I was able to teach myself a new craft this year and I'm enjoying it a lot. Uh, so first things first, I did come from Michael's today. Today is November 1st. I had actually placed an order for curbside pickup and I placed the order because it was a 50% off coupon. So I got a another Q-snap and the more I'm looking at this, I hope this is not the same size as the other one I got. This one may be bigger. This is an 11 by 11. So I'm hoping this one is bigger because that was the point of me getting it. I wanted a larger one. I will say right now for me, just starting out, I really am trying to find the things that I actually really, really like so I can continue to use them and not have to purchase different kinds uh the first set of hoops i purchased were more rectangular and square but they had the screw <clears throat> not like this i like this much better so i got this one from michael so it's 50 percent off and of course while you're there you walk around you look around i didn't pick up any patterns from them uh, but I did pick up some Ada. I picked up this white DMC and this is 28 count. Let's see here. It's 20 by 24 inches. So I did pick this up. Um, they had a coupon with it was 20% off your entire purchase. I got this one. And the other one I got was a 14 count. And it's this baby yellow. It it kind of looks almost like it's yellow. I hope you guys can see what it, the color it looks like on camera. And it is 20 by 24 inches. So I got both of those also from Michaels today. And maybe a couple weeks ago, I don't know if I showed you guys this, but I did pick up the Just Cross Stitch 2023 Special Holiday Issue Christmas Ornaments. But I have seen a different one online, but I haven't seen it at Joann's. But it's a different one of these. If you guys have the Just Cross Stitch and it's different than this one, let me know where you got it from. Because I would love to pick it up. I've seen the cover. And I wonder if that's the one where Maroni. Mar well, I know her as Maroni Crafts from Instagram. Even though I do follow her on YouTube. I believe she is in that one. So I don't know if that is for 2023. Or if she got an early edition 
for January 2024. I don't know why that. I'm using my Mac again. I, do, I think, is it because I did this? <gasps> it's because I did that, child. I'll learn. I will learn. <laughs> but I want to get it. I want to definitely get the one with Marumi um, in it um, because I would love to have her pattern and see the little article snippet that they wrote about her. I think it's awesome. Next, of course, we all know Joanne Fabrics had a huge DMC sale where the normal price of the DMC is 66 cents. They had it on sale for 45 cents. So I did go in ready to go. I had my um, projects pulled up on my phone. Uh, um, I knew I was ready to go through with all the colors. And I can tell you right now, they had every last color I needed. Every last one. There wasn't anything that was missing. Um, in this basket, I got this from the Dollar Tree. Isn't it cute? So they're all in here, but these all did not come from Joanne Fabrics. Uh, I can't tell you how many I purchased from Joanne's. It may have been 50. I don't know. But I also got about 50 from the DMC website because they were having a 30% off sale. So, no, I can't remember. I'm saying I got 50 from them, but I'm thinking I actually got 70 from them. So, um, those are in here too. And I think I'm good. This is going to drive me crazy. I'm just going to be patient when it's time to separate these and then get them on the bobbins. Um, I just have them in here for now because that's something I need to do like while I'm on vacation. <laughs> while I'm on vacation, I know this is going to take forever. I have no idea how many are in here, but I will show you this just to add on to it. I got this from Timu. And it's these here. This is a DMC color. Even though it's not a DMC brand, it's, I don't know. I don't know what this is. Aro, A-I-R-O. It was one, Timu. But how you purchase it, it wasn't that it was all these <clears throat> different colors. It was just, you had a choice, I believe, of several different DMC colors, but you could only get like 10, 20. You had to get it all like the one color. So for example, if it was 666, that's the color you chose. It wasn't you mixing up all these other colors. You can only get 666. So that's how I got this, and it's 20 of them. And that's because I am going to be doing a cross stitch. I believe it is a Quaker cross stitch where it's going to be all one color. And this is the color that I chose. And this is 3766. And when I was in my live, I looked, I checked, I made sure, yes, this is the color. So there are... 20 of them here which I'm going to keep separate from everything else in this basket and while I have you guys here I got these little plastic baggies from Timu also sorry about the glare there was 10 of them that came with the little loops on the end hooks on the end. So this is what it looks like. Very, very nice. And it's like Ziploc. It's just like a Ziploc bag. So I will be using these also just um, for extra storage with 
uh, my floss. Can you guys tell me what this is called? Is this a skein? <laughs> is this a skein? Am I saying that right? I don't know. I think I'm saying it right. So I have these in here ready to go. I'm trying to figure out where I got that pattern from. I'll be able to show you guys week three of this month. I'll be able to show you then. Right now, I'm not for sure. So in here, I would say this is probably more than 100. So I'm set. I have several different patterns that I made sure I had the DMC for. I would honestly say probably for about seven to ten of them, okay? And I'm sure I overlapped, which is okay by me. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, with the sale at Joann's with the 45 cents for the uh, DMC floss, they also had a 60% a off one item, one regular price item. So I picked up this, this DMC Ada 14 count, and this one is 48 by 60 inches, and that's because I will just cut it myself. For anybody who's a beginner, I'll probably show you how I cut my Ada um, before the end of the year, but yes, I will just cut this to the size that I need it to be for my pattern myself. And that's why I got such a huge, I felt like that would be a good deal to get 60% off this. This was about, on an estimate, $25 before the discount, before the discount. So I picked this up. And don't y'all love my baskets? I got some really, really nice baskets from the Dollar Tree. Really nice. They didn't have white. My, all my other baskets are white. They didn't have it, so I just got black. Um, the next thing I got were the plastic bobbins. I like these bobbins. I don't know. I see a few people on YouTube um, who use them when they're kitting up their cross stitch, but, 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 but. I will say, when you have a huge, like these ladies who do this heaven and earth design, or they're doing something with like 35, 50 colors, I see where you would want to use the floss drops. Um, this probably wouldn't work so well. Uh, but for right now, when I kit up, I just kit up on the silver ring, and I use this, and I like it. So I... Oopsie. <laughs> so I got this big bag because I have so many new um, flosses that need to be placed on here. I do have the little DMC stickers, but I'm not seeing too many people use these. I'm not seeing too many people that use these. I see more people writing than I do see them using the actual sticker. So, I don't know. I, I'm not sure about that yet. I picked those up a while ago from Joann's, but these did come from Timu, and I think they're fine. They feel fine. Yeah, they feel fine to me. They have the slits. They have the hole there for the the ring. So I'll be getting those all set up. I go on vacation for Thanksgiving and Christmas, so I'll have plenty of time to get this taken care of. Um, the next thing I purchased were more needles. I honestly think these are... There's 25 needles in here. It comes in this cute little wooden case. 
I think these are different sizes too. But this is how it comes. And then it's just a screw off top. The needles are in here. Yeah, like this one is huge. Bruh, this one is huge. Don't poke yourself, Suzette. Look how big that is. That thing's gigantic. They're not all that big. They're not. Some of them are uh, much smaller. And I don't mind, if it's something that's not expensive, I don't mind testing it out. Like I will not buy um, 11 count Ada. I found some at my local Goodwill. It had never been opened. The packet had never been opened, had not been touched. Everything was fine. I don't like it. I don't like it. But a lot of times that's what the stamps come on. It never bothered me before, but that one I didn't like. Um, the next thing I did purchase were these clips. I have used these before. I have used these with diamond painting uh, to kind of hold the ends. So my diamond painting, if it needs to be rolled up, I can roll it up and it stays that way. I bought it. It came in this little cute box here from Amazon. And I bought this a couple years ago. So what I'll... That's what they look like. The color doesn't bother me that they're all green. So I'll just take these and put them and add them to this. My personal opinion, they break. I mean, I don't think they're meant for you to have forever, but when I was in Joanne's and I saw what I thought looked just like this, they were expensive. I mean, expensive. Expensive. So I just got them off Timo. They break. I toss them because they're they're cheap. But um, let me see something. Hold on. I'll show you guys. And usually, I don't know what you all use these for. They're like alligator clips. <laughs> I use it to hold my Ada out of the way. So my I'm not like getting my floss hooked on the end of it. I'm not, you know, putting the needle through it. So if there's extra Ada that is hanging off the end of my hoop, I kind of fold it and put this on there to kind of keep everything out the way. How do you use yours? I'm going to put these in here. And I think this is 50. This is a bag of 50. It did come in different colors. I just chose green. It didn't matter to me. So. But yes, I will say none of these, as I was pouring them in, did I see any of them that were broken. I did not see any that were broken. So I'll just keep them in in here, my little tin. And let's see here. I got a couple of more things that are similar and that's the threaders. Um, I have the, the blue threader with the three ends. I like that one a lot, but I always end up using the wire reap the wiry end to thread my needle. So I did get this. I believe this is a pack of 50. Like if this was $2, I don't even think it was. It could have been. But this is what it looks like. Yeah, there we go. I need help with the needle threading. I know that the eye of that needle was huge, but I still can't. <laughs> I still can't do it. And I'm gonna tell you, that's why I bought so many of these. 
Cause these, I think after some, you know, so much usage, the wire gets a little weak and it can come out. But I got those. I also got these here. This is a 10 pack. Again, come in different colors. The colors don't bother me. It's fine. So I have these. Um, when I got that Winnie the Pooh stamped cross stitch, it came with one of these and it actually lasted a really long time before the wire came out. So I got this one. What is this part for? Do we know? Do we know? I don't know. So I got that. And then the last set I got, yeah, I got a bunch of letters. This was like less than a dollar. Timu people, Timu. I have not had a problem with Timu. I'm thinking. Not to my knowledge. Not to my knowledge. I've purchased personal stuff, diamond painting stuff, uh, coloring. I haven't had a problem. So the next one, this one has, these are 20. I don't too much care for these. Then why did you buy them, Suzette? Because, just in case. <laughs> just in case. They don't seem like they fit through the eye of the needle. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm all over the place. But I got these. I'm telling y'all, just, it, it's not expensive. If I had my phone, I would look it up and tell you guys how much each item costs. But I don't have my phone. So that also came from Timu. I got, um... Everything I purchased from Timu, I'm telling you when I was done and checked out, it was probably $35. Um, the next thing I got was these little princesses. I will be ordering mini magnets. I need to find mini thin magnets. I was looking on Amazon today. Now, these ones, I can honestly say... They're all right. They're not terrible. They're usable. All of the things. Sorry, I can't figure out where it starts. But I did notice one of them had a mark on her face. You get 10 of these little princesses. And Tiana is not in here. Stop putting Tinkerbell on everything. Tinkerbell is not a princess. But anywho. You see Tinkerbell's face? I hope I can get her on the camera right. You see that little green mark on her face? That she came like that. But there's two of each kind. So I have another Tinkerbell, which I think is, I think she's fine. Yeah. She's fine. And it comes with, I believe this is supposed to be Belle. And I'm just going to show you guys real quick. They're flat on the back. So I just need a tiny, thin magnet. And these will be needle minders for me. Here is Frozen. Y'all, my kids, my, my daughter knows this. I know her name. <laughs> oh, Lord. See, aren't they cute? And then you just put the little magnet on the bag. And I use E6000 glue. Boom. And see, to me, these are tiny enough. A lot of my cover minders that I have for Diamond Mini are bigger. They're bigger, so, you know, they're kind of bulky. But anywho, there's 10 of them. There's two of each, and they're super cute. They're really, really cute. 
And that was the only one. The one Tinkerbell that that was the only one that had something on her face. But it's fine. I just won't use it. I'm dropping everything. I just won't use it. I'm not gonna send it back for that one. Um next I have I did buy these, I bought two sets. And the number goes up to 74, if I'm not mistaken. Let me check, yeah. It goes up to 74. So this is almost like the, is this called a floss card? What is going to be considered? But it's basically, this is how you could kit up also. So you would kit up using one of these. This one goes from 1 to 37. And what you would do is, from what I'm learning, is you would really want to have them in order. You would really want to have them in order, be in DMC order. So then when you get to, if it's one, you know just to go straight to, to one. I'm not saying that. It's just like that in painting. Just, just like that in painting. How on the schematic is in DMC order, chronological, smallest to the largest. That's how you want to have it set up on here. Um, and what else do I have? I have no idea why I ordered this. I think it just got in my... I think it got in my car accidentally. I will find something for it. I have no idea why I ordered this. I, I don't know. That was an accident. I did get some really nice um, scissors. These also came from Timu. Ooh, they're stiff. This is what they look like. They're stiff. They're cold too. And it does come with a plastic little cover, just safety reasons, because they are sharp. So I did get these. I do have other little scissors that I do use, and I did, honestly, I bought one of the pairs from the Dollar Tree. They work just fine this is just me being bougie and extra <laughs> you, don't have to have these. you don't have to have these honestly um i also got another one of these i love this i have one that i ordered earlier this year that i keep my washi tape in uh because i use the washi tape for my diamond paintings I love this. So it's like this on the inside. I will be putting, storing my TMC gloss in here. There's three levels. I don't remember how much this was. Less than $10. I, I can't remember how much it was. It wasn't expensive because I wouldn't have bought it. But it's really nice. It's made really well. When it's clamped, it's clamped. I love this. So I got that. Um, there was something I did get for my daughter because of the diamond painting. I got her these little cute little stickers. So you gotta paint the stickers and then like she could put them on her little folders uh, for school or her and her friends can do some together and decorate them and then they could just add them on to whatever. But I actually got it for her. They're all sweets like candy and milkshakes and ice cream. I actually got them for her so she could just diamond paint um, and then put them on her folders. And I think this is the last thing I got. I believe 
I've got these Santa earrings. And I believe, and I know we just got out of Halloween. I'm telling you, I believe I'm buying stuff super early because if you don't, it'll be gone. So if you see it, you like it, get it. Mm -mm. Let me take it out. Isn't he cute? Let me take it out the plastic. I have bought earrings from Timu before. They do not irritate my ears. My ears. So I have bought several pair. Um, and they're just they're just budget friendly. Just novelty, I should say. Novelty earrings. And it's Santa, and he's on both sides. He's on both sides. Y'all, I am just furious. Is he not cute? I love it. I think he's adorable. So that, that is all I have. I did download the newest Heaven and Earth Design free uh, cross-stitch pattern that they have on their website. I'll show you how, when I download those, I'm going to show you guys what I do with them. I'll show you guys what I do with those. Um, I thought I was going to do something crazy for the Christmas holiday, but I don't believe so. I think I'm gonna stay like where I'm at. Cause I feel like I tried to jump in too fast because I like it so much. So I need to kind of settle down and uh, get my bearings, work on what I have and learn new stitches and things like that before I start trying to jump in the deep end. So I'm gonna like take a pause on that. I will, uh, I did start a Christmas cross stitch. I did already start it, um, but I'll continue, I'll work on that. But there's a couple things that I wanna get done first. So hopefully within the next two weeks when I come back and see you guys, I'll have a finish to show you. Um, I don't think there's anything else today. I think that's all I have. Alrighty, guys. So, if you all have any suggestions or anything for me, you know I always welcome any kind of suggestions that you may have. Thank you all so much for watching. If you stay all the way to the very end, if you could leave me a... Give me a second, let me think. <laughs> a blue heart emoji. Just leave me a blue heart emoji. Um, that helps my channel and it helps to get recommended to others who may be starting their journey with cross stitch. Thank you all so much for watching. You all remember to stay beautiful and to stay blessed. Bye. <laughs>